like Colton is questioning going home. What? And I feel like he thinks that if he is not here, that I will be able to open up to other people. But there's I, a romanticism between you guys. I'm confused. You know what, Crystal? I thought there was, and now today I'm like, just not changed? sure. I know that Colton cares for me, but that doesn't mean he's just automatically decisive about what he wants. I don't want either of us to leave wishing that we could have done something better or differently. Do you want Colton? Like, yeah. do you want Colton? You want Colton? Yeah. Like, I can't help that that's how I feel. You're wearing your heart when you're asleep to him, but he won't commit to you, so it's really scary. Yeah. Right? Yeah, and like, he thinks that if he leaves, it will allow me to clear my mind. No, but like, all my eggs are in his basket, and he's not even, he doesn't even have a basket, because he, can't, he can't reciprocate it. I want Colton. It's that simple. So if he leaves, I don't know if I should even stay. If he goes home, my chance to reignite with Colton is over. It's just a mess. And like, I feel like it's been a mess from the, from the beginning, but I've been hopeful and like, I don't want to feel like I'm not hopeful. I think this, I think that he should know by now. Yeah. So much of my life, I've thought of like everything else. Like, think about how much fun you and Tia can be having in paradise. Like, nobody else has the story that you and Tia have. Right. Tia and Colton have this really great story. I really would love to know what that feels like because I haven't had the happiest of endings. Colton just needs to see it. Stop acting like little babies and accept it and move forward. It's obvious that this girl really feels for you. And it's obvious that you might be rejecting your own feelings for her. What do you feel when it's you easy. like talk it's to easy. her? It's easy. Because it's easy. Like we just we have a good conversations always. Why complicated? I definitely feel like you're connected to her. I am. No matter what happens, and I that's will. enough, Colton. Everyone just keeps saying to me, like, wait around for that person. Here's a person that's, like, madly in love with you. Do not complicate it. In the end, the only person she's waiting to decide is you. My two choices are go home or pursue Tia. She's obviously somebody very special. And part of me really wants to try. Then I have this other part in me that's telling me not to because I'm scared to hurt her. Knowing that there's even a possibility that she could get hurt with me. You're gonna get your drink? You go talk? I mean, there's been so much wishy-washy. On her like, end and his end. Conversations each and every single day with him. Yeah. Like, I don't love Becca. Two days later, I'm crying. I'm crying. I'm crying because Becca just walked down the stairs. Home. I'm going to explore my options, but keep tea on the table. Then he's batting down a date card. Yeah, dude, this guy's all over the place. He's a mess. Huge mess. Where, where are we going? The Colin and Tia cloud gets bigger and bigger. And it's like almost affecting the sunlight that we're getting and people are just over it. Let us enjoy paradise. Let us not have to worry about all your issues and drama. Let us live. Hey, Dad, I'm gonna take my training wheels off the bicycle. Ah! You know, that's, that's what I think's gonna happen, so. Wow. I know. What's that? Like, no matter what, no matter how any of this plays out, I feel like the moment I stepped down here, there's just been this pressure on both of us yeah. to, like, figure our out and figure this out and work through this. We could say we were confused, is uncertain, all that stuff, but I think the bottom line is like, obviously I care for you, obviously I'm protective of you. And if this didn't work, the thought of hurting you scares the out of me. 
let's be real, I can't date somebody else. It's not what I'm here for now. So what does that mean? I think that you and I owe each other an opportunity and a chance to really do this. We need to give this an honest go. You're choosing me. I am. I'm happy when I'm with you. I have fun when I'm with you. Like, it's effortless. <laughs> and I'm finally not scared. <laughs> and let's see where this thing goes. I'm ready. Who's that? That's Colton and Tia. So, <laughs> is that a thing now? All I've wanted is just an honest chance. I was used as a pawn. Is that fair to say it? Chris, I'm gonna be a little bit of a bitch. It was never about you. <laughs> it's been a long six months of toying with the idea of having a relationship with this person that wasn't attainable. The second Colton walked down on the beach, I knew that I wanted it with him. We know that we want to try to make this work. That's all we can do is try and give it an honest chance. Like, I'm the happiest person in Mexico right now. Like, use your tongue.